Your colleague, Congresswoman Alyssa Slotkin, recently said that the brand of the National Democratic Party is mushy. I'm curious if you think that there's truth to that. I've said that we need to get better at getting our message and our truth out there so in a way that the American people can digest that truth and then decide who they're going to vote for. So if she's describing it as mushy, I describe it as something we can shape. Which is mushy. If she says it's, it's mushy, so, well, if it's something it, that you can shape, it, right? It's like not something that's fully formed absolu or absolutely. concrete. I'm I'm an engineer, and I've been trained that my job is to take something and fix it and make it better. And the beautiful thing about what I've been trained is there's no one right answer. Democrats say that all the time. We're a big tent, a big family. I'm curious, as you've seen the Republican Party over the last four years under Donald Trump really kind of coalesce and their their tent, so to speak, get ever smaller. To, to follow Donald Trump, if that makes you rethink if the Big Ten is still effective in being able to govern effectively. Yeah, they got in line with Donald Trump. No matter how atrocious he was, no matter what he said or what he did, they felt, in my opinion, as though they didn't have the right to speak up and to speak out about the truth. So you'd rather have a party where some members are speaking out against others than one that's kind of just following the leader? Absolutely. Disagree if you have to, but don't hurt each other. Don't tear each other apart. And that's what I believe that we're gonna be able to do.